Hexagon Live is a great place to launch new products and I've found a new one here. Christopher's joining me. Christopher, what are we looking at here? So this is the all new BLK360. Uh, we just released it yesterday. Um, yeah, I mean, it's super exciting. A lot smaller, a lot faster. A great new addition to the, the BLK family. Okay, so smaller, yeah. faster. Yep. What about scanning precision? Yeah, so it's actually 33% more accurate. Or the uh, the previous version was uh, six millimeter accuracy. Um, this one is now four millimeters. Uh, and again, as far as speed or scanning, uh, you can get uh, HDR scan at a lower resolution, about 20 seconds, or it used to take about two and a half minutes. And the very longest scan possible on here at full resolution, full HDR, which actually now is five stage HDR versus three stage. Uh, at most 95 seconds. So you're going along very fast, um, and even the internal storage, you can get a lot more scans. Um, 180 gigs of storage versus 32 gigs. Just pretty much looked at every, every facet of how we can make it faster, quicker. And the imagery itself, uh, with, the, with the four HDR cameras on one side, it's now two stops to collect the full panoramic uh, image versus used to take 10 stops before on the previous, so just much, much faster all around. I'd like to say bigger and better, but it's actually smaller and better. Exactly right, yeah. What about data processing once you've done the scans? How's that, has it changed in any way? Sure, the, the actual processing itself isn't too much different, but as far as downloading the data, there has been uh, definitely some big improvements. So we now have, uh, as small as it may seem, it's a great, great addition having a USB-C uh, downloadable port. Uh, where we didn't have that before, it was only Wi-Fi. Uh, you still have the option to, to download via Wi-Fi, uh, and even that is twice as fast as the previous version. If you use the USB-C port, it's about nine times faster to, to download the data. Um, but as far as uh, scanning with it, much like the RTC, um, you now have the dual syncing happening. So if you're using a Field360 app, um, you're taking geotags, you're doing the registrations, it's actively syncing back to the unit, so you don't have to download from Field360. You can just you know, turn off your, your iPhone or your iPad and just take this back, plug in the USB-C port, and download it right into Register360, and everything will be right there. Um, and so yeah, so that, that part of the processing has, has improved. And then uh, as well as, much like not only is that taken from the RTC, but also the Viz technology. So registering on the go, anytime you pick up the unit, those cameras are being activated, tracking it to its next location, and further along speeds up that process. Well, where do you see this new device being used? In what kind of applications? Because there's a lot of, lot of laser reality capture solutions now coming out of, yeah. uh, out of Hexagon. Sure. But where do you see this one fitting? Yeah, I mean, I would say a lot of our, you know, traditional is, is even the previous one, you know, the building industry, um, you know, plant. Uh, we're also trying to get bigger into the, the VFX industry. Um, that's, that's blowing up, you know, anytime you have to even blow something up in the visual effects world, uh, you know, take a scan of it, it, it drastically uh, reduces the time to, to create a 3D model of, of something, a very nice mesh, you know, taking a scan, turning it into a mesh, putting a nice texture on it, um, you know, we, yeah, so that's another area. Um, but I mean, pretty much anything at the very simplest form, anytime you have to take something, you know, physical and, and create digital out of it, there's a fit, you know. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, many, many applications. Well, as I say, smaller and better. Thanks, Christopher, for taking us through yeah. the new BLK360. And of course, you can find out more, just visit Leica.com.